Okay, hey guys, this is Alan with Bothell STEM Coach, and today I'm bringing you the next free response question from the 2016 AP Calculus exam. Um, so let's look at number four. Consider the differential equation dy dx equals y squared over x minus one. On the axis provided, sketch the slope field for the given differential equation at the six points indicated. Okay, so it's really plugging in points here. Uh, at zero, x equals zero, y equals one. I have one over negative one, so that's a negative one. So the slope looks, that's what negative one slope looks like. At y equals two, it's four over negative one. So it's a little steeper like this. And then nine is even steeper. Oh, whoops, uh, they didn't ask about that one. So at zero, zero, it's just zero because it's zero over negative one, which is zero. At two, two, zero, it's also zero. At um, 2, 1, remember this is the point 2, 1. So what I'm doing is I'm just plugging in x equals 2, y equals 1, that's positive 1. And then for at x equals 2 and y equals 2, that's 4 over 1. That's even steeper. Okay, so something like that. Um, yeah. Let y equals f of x be the particular solution to the differential equation with initial condition f of 2 equals 3. Write an equation for the line tangent of the graph at y equals f of x, at x equals 2 and use your approximation. Okay, so I need equation of a line. What am I going to use? I'm going to use slope point y minus y naught equals m x minus x naught. Now, uh, the point is uh, x equals 2, y equals 3. So y minus 3 equals m, x minus 2. Because the tangent line has to go through that point at a minimum. And it also has to have the same slope there. So what's the slope? The slope's given by the differential equation. If I plugged in um, y squared, the y value is 3. So that's 9 over 2 minus 1. That's 1. That's equal to 9. So it's y minus 3 equals 9, x minus 2. So that's y equals 9x um, minus 18 plus 3. That's minus 15. So if I plug in 2, I get 3. OK, good. And then I want to approximate um, f of uh, 2.1 is equal to 9 times 2.1 minus 15. And that's uh, no calculator. That's 18.9 minus 15. That's equal to 3.9. Yeah, and that which makes sense because if I move over 0.1, the slope is 9, I should go up 0.9. Find the particular solution to the given differential equation with that initial condition. So let's find the exact solution for this. Uh, separation of variables is the only technique that you would know at this point. And then I'm going to integrate both sides. So I put all the x's on one side, all the y's on one side. This is negative 1 over y equals natural log absolute value x minus 1. I can drop the absolute value because uh, they tell me x um, is 2. So that means it's 2 minus 1 is positive. So <clears throat> yeah. Uh, oh, I got a plus c here. So, um, let's see, I'm going to multiply by negative 1, so I get 1 over y equals negative natural log x minus 1. That negative doesn't change that plus c, it just makes it a plus a different constant. <clears throat> and then um, I flip it, y equals 1 over negative natural log x minus 1 plus c. Okay, and then uh, I need to solve for the initial value where 3 is equal to 1 over negative natural log 2 minus 1 plus c. Now, natural log of 1 is 0, so that's just equal to 1 over c, so that means c is equal to uh, 1 third. So my final answer is f of x or y is equal to 1 over 1 third minus natural log x minus 1. 
And I believe that should be correct. Let's double check that I did all that right. Yep. Okay, that was a quick one. Let's look at the scoring for that one. These look right. 3.9, and that equation is right. One third minus, note this solution is valued. I don't need to do, yeah, that's just a note there. Okay, well, I hope you guys uh, enjoyed that one. Um, please leave a comment, like, or subscribe, and I'll see you in the next free response question. Thanks. Thanks for watching the video, guys. I just want to let you know that I offer free homework help on Twitch or Discord. So uh, just stop on by if you have any homework questions or you just want to learn about different parts of math and physics and hang out. Hope to see you there.